Abigail Sanderson and I'd love to be your next TV Blue Peter presenter. I'm currently a teacher, I work in a high school during the week teaching year 7 to year 9 and on the weekend I work at a performing arts school and the work they produce is phenomenal when I can give something back to the students and they take that on board and really work with it is what makes my day. I think it's the most wonderful thing so to be able to do that on a larger scale nationwide would be my dream job. What ages would you recommend could come to a place and a course like this and take part in the activities? Uh, anyone over the age of 10 can come along. Yeah, have you got anything for the lower, the lower age group? Some parts of the country we've got junior courses we've just started doing so that's from four years old and upwards. Awesome so. and they could expect things like this? Yeah just a little bit, a little bit lower little down, bit a little bit safer so yeah. Yes. Cool, right, so nice and easy, big waistband at the top here, two leg loops down there. Just right. step through, work a pair of shorts, and that'll work at the front, and just hold it up nice and high. Okay. Tight, pair of shorts. So hopefully this will hold my weight, it's going to hold my weight, yeah? Oh yes, it most definitely will. So I'm not going to be falling out of any trees. <laughs> As you can see, I'm already wearing a Blue Peter badge. It's not mine, unfortunately. Hopefully one day I will have one. Um, this is my dad's. He got it a very long time ago and I asked to borrow it. So some of you who have little sisters or brothers, I bet they've got at home a tube they crawl through. This is what this is reminding me of. However, this is a wooden tube stuck between two trees in the middle of the air. Myself, make sure you tie it back so it doesn't get caught in any of the rope or the harness here otherwise that will hurt. Two, shoes, sensible shoes, perhaps some trainers, something with a good grip on it so when you're climbing up those ladders you don't slip off. If you're coming in the winter like we are today, March, well it's supposed to be spring, it's very cold though, make sure you wear a waterproof jacket. I'm a very creative person, in my spare time I like to play piano and I enjoy singing as well and my favourite hobby at the moment is to paint. I use acrylic and watercolour. Another thing, gloves. Something I didn't come prepared for. You're holding onto this rope. It gets quite tough after a while. Have a wonderful time. I've had an awesome time here today and I'm definitely coming back. So I've completed my challenge in the treetops of Go Ape at Trent Park. It was an adventurous experience which I loved even though I was very scared of heights. So my students have gifted me with a nickname. Brave from the new Disney film, mainly because of the hair. I'll let you into a little secret though. I do own a bow and arrow. Shh. Oh, welcome back. You survived. Oh, just I finished. You got over your fear of heights then. Yes. All I all I had to do was look at the next tree. Just always look at the next tree, like we said. Just don't look down. <laughs> so, so well done. Congratulations, Abby. You get your certificate. Thank you, you very much. Fun. So much fun.